Tuesday afternoon on demand storm tracker forecast. I'm Chief Meteorologist Mike Hurd around 1 p.m. here at the time we're recording this for our online users. You can see a deep trough sitting across the central and southern Rockies over into the central plains. A couple of storm systems there, but those are mostly downstream. The next weather maker for us is a little clipper storm dropping in from the north and west following the polar jet stream and this will bring back another chance for some mountain snow showers Wednesday evening into Thursday but snow appears to be tapering although we do expect to see at least a few snow showers locally in southwest Montana up until about sunset but skies should be clearing after that so this winter weather advisory is still in play until 6 p.m. tonight but I'm not seeing a lot of additional snow around the region just a little bit of hit and miss uh, scattered snow showers and it's having just a minor impact on travel but our model is showing clearing skies, colder temperatures tomorrow morning, but here comes the next disturbance, and this could bring back another chance for some passing snow showers Wednesday evening into Thursday morning. And we could be picking up a couple of inches, uh, especially over mountains and passes, but even some of our lower valleys, again, Wednesday evening into Thursday morning, has a chance for seeing an inch or two of snow, but it will melt off in the late afternoon hours as temperatures should warm above freezing so you can see there are some local spots there like around big sky and cook city that could have a fair amount of new snow so here's the 24-hour forecast for butte uh, tonight teens down about 15 degrees but tomorrow 40 despite mostly cloudy skies and again late day snow showers are possible for bozeman colder in the morning down in around 17 degrees and a lower 40 is possible uh, tomorrow afternoon. Bozeman slightly higher probability for a few flakes and minor snow accumulations Wednesday evening into Thursday morning.